How to find means and standard deviations using an Excel spreadsheet. It's quite easy. So what you're going to do is you're going to pick a cell where you want the mean to show up. So I'm picking that cell. I'm going to go to the function bar, that little f of x. Click it. Category, pick statistical. And mean is average. We pick that button. And this is the computer's idea of saying, where do you want the average taken from? In other words, where's the data you want the average from? You simply make sure the cursor's in, the, in this box up here. You click and drag all the data, and you click OK. So there's the mean. If you want to just take it out to two place values, you go up to the little eggs up here, and you click it down until you get two. So to find the standard deviation, you click a cell that you want the standard deviation to show up in. Click that cell. Same process. Go to the function bar. Make sure you're statistical. This time go to St. Dev. That stands for standard deviation. And we always use the St. Dev.S. That means sample. We click OK. Same thing. It's asking where do you want this standard deviation taken from. Make sure the cursor is blinking in the box up there. Highlight the data. Click OK, and I only want two decimals, two place values, do that. And here comes the coolest part about Excel. If you highlight the mean and the standard deviation, so you get that green square, you manipulate your little cursor cross down at the bottom here until it turns into a black little cross. I'll do that again. So you see the big white cross, bottom right hand corner, you grab that, it turns into the little black cross. Click down, drag all the way across, and it will do them all. Okay, so the, these are all the means and standard deviations for these 10 practice questions. I hope that helps. MGZ out.